Uh, good afternoon, I'm Chris Shanko with Site Design Concepts, and we are here on site today to do an as-built survey of uh, a newly constructed infiltration basin, including measuring the tops and inverts of uh, some inlets. Now at our backside point, point number two, I have the rod set up nice and plumb, so I've taken a distance shot between our instrument setup and the backside, and the distance between the two points is perfect and the elevation is within uh, three-eighths of a foot so basically the instrument uh, taking a shot to the back side is set a zero angle so now all our angles will turn off of this back site and we are good to go with our as built okay we're at our first storm inlet so what I've already done is I've located the four corners of the grate that will give us a top of grate elevation and then I've uh, examined the inside of the inlet and found that there was one pipe exiting. So what I did was I measured the diameter and came up with the materials of the pipe. And I was able to get an invert location on that using my uh, survey rod. So this inlet is as built. So we're at the parking lot portion here and we're gonna be locating the curb to make sure uh, everything is flowing towards the basin. So what I'll be doing is taking a bottom of curb shot here, which is at the edge of pavement taking the top of curb shot and that will give us the curb width and give us an elevation at the top of the curb and at the bottom of the curb. We have the curbing all located, so now I'm just going to take a couple top pavement shots in here to show the uh, elevation lowering as it uh, moves the water towards the basin. Next, we're going to be locating the basin itself. So I'm going to be taking locations around the top of bank, bottom bank, probably a couple ground shots in the middle, and from that information, we'll be able to calculate a volume of water that this basin will be able to hold. We have the basin as built right now. We got our tops and bottoms located. So right now I'm gonna move around the outside, away from the top bank, get some ground shots to the existing ground that surrounds the basin. Okay, well that basically wraps up our uh, basin as built. So to finish up here, I'm gonna go back to my backside point and do what's called checking out. Just check and make sure the distance between my setup point and my backside ha have it, hasn't changed. And then I'll take this information back to the office and we'll use these shots to uh, create a record plan, calculate a volume for this basin, and submit that to the powers of B. And that'll wrap this up.